Red Lobster guys for people who want seafood without going to the sea. Hey, funny story guys, I was driving to the beach to get some seafood, but then I saw a Red Lobster on the side of the road, and I thought, hey, I'm gonna save myself an hour's worth of driving by, by getting some Red Lobster. So let's go out here and actually let's repart my car so that I can park next to that pond. I can pretend I'm at the beach. Look at that guys, it's basically an ocean and right there is the pier. Do you think there's a lobster inside? I doubt it. Well, I think it's time, well, I think it's time for another car food review. Red Lobster this time. So let's crack this giant bag open and look how I tore it. I guess I can't resell this bag later on on eBay. Uh-oh, they did it. They put the biscuits in here. I should have told them not to, but these things are so bad for you, but they taste so good. They put two of these biscuits in here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat one, or at least bite one. Oh my God. That could not be healthy. Something that good tasting cannot be healthy at all. So it looks like I'm about to cater someone's wedding. But I got two pieces of fish. Wait, I got, what did I get? One broiled wild caught flounder, one Atlantic salmon, salmon, shrimp scampi, rice, and french fries. You know, I guess this would probably make more sense if I had showed it to you. You know what the rule of guy, the rule of movies is, show them, don't tell them. Ooh. This looks pretty yummy, actually. I don't know if you can see that. I mean, you can, but I can see it. Uh, for some reason, I was craving french fries, I was craving shrimp, and I was craving some kind of fish. I didn't know what kind of fish, so I got two of them. And I got some rice, because I eat my fish with rice whenever I can. So, where did that silverware go? Hello, silverware. One second. Let me put this food up here. Hopefully some... Some duck doesn't eat my food. Yeah, there's a lot of ducks walking around here. It's just Muscovy ducks. You know those ones with the, the weird things on their faces? Muscovy ducks. So, let's start by trying a french fry. Because I love french fries. Hmm. Definitely need ketchup on those fries. Let's try a shrimp. There are quite a bit of these. This is shrimp scampi. It's really hot. Mmm. That is yummy, guys. Yeah, I prefer um, seafood by the ocean. Living in Florida, I, well, I live like an hour from the ocean, so I can get some fresh food. But I was not feeling that drive going all the way out there. And since I haven't had seafood in so long, I probably won't even tell the difference between being fresh and not fresh. So let's let's take a bite into the um, Atlantic salmon here. Here, this is what it looks like. <laughs> As I pick it up like a barbarian, I can't take it off. Here, here it is. Let's try it. Try it with some rice. It's pretty good. Here's the rice. Me being Asian, this isn't enough rice for me. One little cup? No way. Hmm. Let's try the um, the flounder now. The flounder looks really yummy. See this? I It fell apart. I love the way it looks. It just falls apart. That's how you can tell it's really soft. Mm-hmm. Pretty good meal. It, again, it doesn't match going to the freaking ocean and having freshly caught food from the sea, from the ocean. Is the sea the ocean? I forgot. I don't know. But a lot of people knock Red Lobster. Guys, don't knock Red Lobster, guys. It's convenient. You don't have to get all the way to the ocean to get seafood. You can go to Red Lobster and I didn't get any lobster because I, I, I do like lobster. I just didn't want to get red lobster. All right. Gosh, everyone's in my business. And these french fries need ketchup. Goodbye, makeshift ocean. Goodbye. Oh, look at this. 
You're not going to believe this, guys, but there are actually ketchup packets in my in my red lobster bag so I can eat my, my french fries in peace now. Thank you, Heinz.